Welcome to the Mathematics in my channel. Today we are going to talk about great integration question. So the question is integral 0 to 1 x to the x power dx. So first of all if we take x to the x power so we know uh, this is equal to we can change the base so e to the ln x to the x so we can write this e to the x times ln of x and now we know e to the x is equal to 1 plus x plus x square over 2 factorial plus x cube over 3 factorial so on so now we know x to the x power is equal to e to the x times natural log of x so this is equal to according to this 1 plus now x is equal to x times natural log of x so x ln of x plus x ln of x square over 2 factorial plus x ln x to the third power over 3 factorial plus cos to infinity okay now our question is 0 to 1 x to the x power dx so now we can evaluate this integral by evaluating this integral so 0 to 1 1 plus x times ln of x plus x time ln of x square over 2 factorial plus x time ln of x to the third power over 3 factorial and so on dx now 0 to 1 or well, we can write this by sum of 0 to infinity x times natural log of x to the nth power over n factorial dx okay now we can write this part outside of the integer so 0 to infinity integer from 0 to 1 x times natural log of x to the nth power over n factorial dx and also we can write n factorial in outside of the integer so 1 over n factorial 0 to 1 now we can write this part x to the nth power natural log of x to the x power dx okay now we need to evaluate this integral so if we take u is equal to minus natural log of x so natural log of x is equal to minus u so x is equal to e to the minus u and now differentiate with respect to x so we can write du is equal to minus 1 over x dx now isolate the dx so dx is equal to minus x times du so we can write minus x so x is equal to e to the minus u so minus times e to the minus u du now we want to change the limit so x approaches to 0 so u approaches to minus natural log of 0 so we want to put the mark plus because that the limit of natural log of x when x approaches to 0 from the positive side okay so this is minus times minus infinitive so plus infinitive and x approaches to 1 so u approaches to minus natural log of 1 so this is equal to 0 okay now we can write our integral 0 to 1 x to the x dx 
so this is equal to this part so sum of 0 to infinity 1 over n factorial now the limit so 0 so infinity to 0 now x is equal to e to the minus u to the nth power times natural log of x is equal to minus u nth power so this is not x this is n and dx is equal to minus e to the minus u du so we can write 0 to infinity 1 over n factorial now we can change the limit so 0 to infinity but this minus get cancelled so now e to the minus u and e to the minus u so e to the minus u n plus 1 and this is minus 1 to the nth power and u to the nth power du now we can write minus 1 to the nth power in outside of the integer so n is equal to 0 to infinity now minus 1 to the nth power over n factorial 0 to infinity e to the minus u times n plus 1 times u to the nth power du okay now we want to evaluate uh, this integer so if we take substitutive method uh, so if we take t is equal to u times n plus 1 so by differentiate so dt is equal to n plus 1 du so du is equal to dt over n plus 1 and u is equal to t over n plus 1 so we can write 0 to 1 x to the x power dx is equal to sum of 0 to infinity minus 1 to the nth power over n factorial and 0 to infinity and now we know this is e to the uh, u times n plus 1 so minus t and u n now u is t over n plus 1 so t to the nth power over n plus 1 to the nth power and du so du is dt over n plus 1 so we can write 0 to infinity minus 1 to the nth power over n factorial and this is n plus 1 to the nth power times n plus 1 so n plus 1 to the n plus 1 power and 0 to infinity u to the minus t t to the nth dt okay now we can write n is equal to 0 to infinity u minus 1 to the nth power over n factorial times n plus 1 to the n plus 1 power and we know this is gamma of n plus 1 so n is equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 to the nth power over n factorial times n plus 1 to the n plus 1 power and we know gamma of n plus 1 is equal to n factorial and n factorial get cancelled so we can write n is equal to infinity minus 1 to the nth power over n plus 1 to the n plus 1 power okay and now our question 0 to 1 x to the x dx so this is equal to 0 to infinity 2 minus 1 into 
power n plus 1 to the n plus 1 so when n is equal to 0 this is 1 and n is equal to 1 so minus 1 over 2 square and plus 1 over 3 to the third power and minus 1 over so on so this is the answer if you like this video please subscribe this channel thank you for watching